we should have realized how corrupt our system was, is, back in 2004, when the Carrie Edwards uh, candidacy was put up on a pedestal by the Democratic Party. We should have known then that it's whoever makes the most money wins, even if they're the shittiest candidate. We deserved to have Bush for a second term because we weren't willing to look at the corruption. And uh, this, this time around, we deserve to have Trump as a president because of people, some people, not being willing to look at how corrupt our system is. There's a silver lining, though. There's a silver lining to this whole thing. A Trump presidency would bring a lot of people together to actually look at what are our values. What do we actually stand for? What is our way of life? It will make us reevaluate a lot of stuff. Even though it's the reason for the reevaluation is because everything would be turning to shit. We will lose our standing across the globe. People are going to lose a lot of rights. Our economy is going to be suffering. But at least we'll be questioning some of the things we should be questioning and should have always been questioning. And at least the whole polarization between the SJWs and the anti-SJWs may come to an end because the SJWs will actually be complaining about things that are tangible and reasonable to complain about. And the anti-SJWs will eventually go, oh, I guess they're actually complaining about real things now. What are we fighting about? So there's a silver lining to the idea of a Trump presidency. A silver lining in a sea of shit. But we deserve it. And maybe by the, the end of a Trump presidency, we'll actually realize how corrupt our system is. Because that's one thing I think having someone like Trump will show us. When there is someone who is not part of this system already of full-fledged corruption becoming president. When there is someone that's not part of that game. They're part of other games. Trump is obviously part of the corporate game. But because of the way that he does things, I think there's going to be a little bit more transparency and not out of uh, not deliberate transparency but out of stupidity out of Trump being an idiot so if Trump becomes president we get what we deserve I'm still voting for Jill Stein because in this state my vote doesn't matter at least not this year anyway so uh Enjoy.